the 9899 EX Century. This is the Dunkin' Donuts, so playing on the Dunkin' Donuts. Uh, all the New Englanders love that. Uh, so this is one that has shot up significantly in value recently. Uh, and it's no wonder why, you know, just a very classic design, a lot of acetate there. Uh, you know, so this is clocking in at about $220, $230 roughly. Uh, but again, these have jumped up significantly in the last, you know, three or four months and don't show any signs of cooling down. So the last one I saw, I think was a little bit over $300. Uh, one key with these is the clarity of that acetate. So you want to see something that's crystal clear. So, you know, you can see there's a little bit of yellowing here. Sometimes some people will take pictures of them. They're in um, top loaders that are yellowed. So you need to be careful there. But these will degrade over time. So I don't want to keep this in the light for too long. Uh, but sometimes people will say there's a gold variant because of the coloration. It's not. It's oxidation. You don't want to see that oxidation happen to your card. Uh, you know, so if you're going to buy one, make sure you're looking for it being as clear as possible. That's definitely what's going to hold the best value over time. It's like a chrome refractor where, uh, or a chrome base that, it, you know, greening or yellowing in this case is prone to happen. Uh, but the best way to, to keep that, uh, from happening is keep it out of the light, keep it out of, you know, air exposure and stuff like that, which sounds kind of funny because you can't really enjoy the card fully. Uh, in that way, but uh, ones that aren't a bad idea to get graded because of that encapsulation and there's some UV protection in graded slabs typically. So, uh, you know, not a bad idea there. I might do that at some point. And it being an acetate, uh, you know, they're a plastic car. They tend to grade well. It's very hard to chip the edges and the corners. But uh, what the key is here on condition is the foil that's on the card, uh, you know, that orange and pink foil. If that stuff starts to get faded or chipped, and again, if there's some yellowing already, that will ding it on value. So, uh, you know, like I said, 20, $220, $230 is roughly the value on these, but sometimes they can go for north of 300 bucks.